I'm William Richardson reporting from outside Moroni Stadium where the UConn men's soccer team opened up their 2015 campaign. It was a home game against St. Francis of Brooklyn, and it was an uneventful game, really. I mean, the fans were out here buzzing. Jonathan the Husky made a surprise appearance at this game, but the game ended in a 0-0 tie. The game was basically a weird one. There were a lot of corner kicks. UConn had eight, and shots was pretty much all UConn 7-5. We were able to talk to Coach Ray Reed along with players Jake Nowinski and Nicholas Zuniga post game. So let's check out that footage. If your players not good or outside backs are not good tonight, you add it all up. If you don't play with strikers, you don't play with a good midfield, and your move backs don't show up, you don't score a goal. I mean, the only way we're going to score a goal tonight is we got lucky. We're obviously disappointed with how we played all together. You know, we wouldn't have wanted to come out with the win, but, you know, I just feel like this is a learning experience for everyone, you know, myself included, with that we know that we have to play better in order to get the results we want. After a game like this, we, we kind of just look forward to the next day. You know, all we're focusing on right now is the next practice. The big story of the game, however, wasn't the scoreboard at the end of the game. It was in the first half. UConn defender Dylan Greenberg went out with an injury, and there was a lot of talk in the press box about exactly what the injury was. But as he was walking off the field, he seemed to mouth the words, I broke my collarbone. We'll see how it is day by day. We'll update you as soon as we hear the most. But that wraps it up for us. UConn men's soccer's next game is on Monday against Quinnipiac right back here at Moroni Stadium. I'm William Richardson, and this is UC Sports.